Hello, I'm Nora from Neon Bean Studio and today I'm gonna show you how to use clipping mask for text tool. So with the clipping mask we can create this awesome effect that these letters are having this kind of pattern in them. So let's get started and see how I did it. Let's go back to my work mode and bring my layers here. So I will first hide my layer, which I already did, and go to my other text layer. So if you don't know how to create text or this shadow, which is visible here, uh, I have already made videos about it and I will put a link in the description for them to for you to see. So uh, here we are, we have this text here and we want to actually go into the group. Okay, we're into the group. This is our shadow layer I have already done. You might not have it, then it looks just like that, but I think it's cooler with the shadow. So then I'm not going to be on the shadow layer because I want to clip this uh, pattern uh, inside of this top layer, okay? And for that, you're gonna need new layer. I have already new layer here, but I'll show you new layer is just from here, okay? But let's undo this with the two fingers. Okay, so let's use this new layer now and let's put some pattern in it, okay? And first, um, you can choose your color. I choose this really neon yellow. Okay, and then let's go to, I go to pixel tools. I already uh, choose ready uh, this pattern, what I want to use. And they were in my pixel uh, brushes. So I'm gonna use this uh, half tone, Kyle's half tone scotch B. Okay, and I'm gonna just paint like that on top of our text. Okay. Okay. And just like that. Okay. And now we just clip it like that with that button here. This is making the clipping mask. And there you go. It's just right inside. So it was that easy. That that was my uh, today's tutorial to show you how to use clipping mask. And uh, hope you uh, see my other videos. And we see soon again. And uh, for today, uh, that was it and bye bye, take care.